Hey guys, I'm going to show you how to fix this problem on Windows 11 operating system. In the first step, we need to simply right click here and select task manager. Then click on run new task, select browse button, then go to this PC, C drive, then open Windows folder. Now find out system32 folder, so double click on it to open it. Then find out cmd.exe file so just scroll down and you will get this cmd.exe so select it and click on open now check this, this check this box and click on ok once we are here we need to execute the command uh, command name is assoc asoc space dot exe equal to exe file and simply hit enter now type exit and we need to execute the next method simply press windows key plus r key together to open run now type here reeg edit and hit enter so this will open registry editor window now we need to just click on this file and select export and then we need to name here B A C K backup and click on save. You can save it uh, in the documents. Select save. Now we need to expand H key classes root. Once we are here, find out dot exe. Just scroll down and you will get this one. So here it is. Simply select it. On the right side, simply right click on this default, then click on modify. Simply check this uh, text, text uh, it is correct or not correct. Make sure this is EXEFILE. -E. So once done, just click on OK. Again, scroll down. Now find out EXE file. So again, just scroll down. So here it is, simply select it on the right side, right click on default, select modify and simply we need to type here percent percent 1 percent star okay get this so click on ok now we need to expand this exe file then expand shell and simply select open again on the right side right click here select modify again do the type same command that is then star then click on ok now search for windows firewall so this is windows defender firewall click on it and then click on turn windows defender firewall on or off simply click on it then we need to check this option that is turn off windows defender wire firewall again from public network settings select this click on ok now close this window simply restart your system and that's it guys your problem will be solved and you are good to go